Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new episode of the Sims 4 Island Challenge. My name is Eros and uh, did you guys know that kids can actually roast fish? Like that was pretty amazing. Uh, I don't know if you guys just saw but Rosie totally just roasted herself a fish. Actually I don't know if she finished because now she's using the bathroom. But if you have her come over here once it's lit again, um, let's go ahead and light this back up. She can actually roast fish. Oh my gosh, you're on fire. Why are you on fire? Maddie. Maddie. Excuse me. Stop getting on fire. It's not cool. Not cool. But um, yeah, like over here, like she can actually roast, which is awesome. Why is there a fire? Why is there always? Why is everything always on fire? Uh, little baby, uh, leave. <laughs> you should run away. <laughs> you think they'd be like better at like fire management now because you know they've been on this island for a while and this has happened quite a few times and they're still they still don't get it they just they just don't get it um but let's see Lacey is currently pregnant uh where is she at she's running away it's okay guys it's okay you know it, it, it ended it's it's okay it's calm down it's it's gonna be fine we're, we're gonna get through this um but she's currently in I think her second trimester um, yeah, she'll be in her third trimester in six hours. So very, very soon, um, she'll be in her third trimester. And that means baby time, baby time. Uh, let's see. Ooh, it looks like Little Leaf is really tired. Why don't we have him go potty? And then he can go to bed over here. And then we need, let's take Maddie. He can actually repair this really fast because he has the super repair skill, which we should start training somebody else to be like super good at repairing as well. Uh, and then this leftover food, we can actually just put back in our little tree hollow that we have. We do have a chest now um, where I've been keeping like their fruits and vegetables in there. And then in here, I've been keeping their fish in here. I gotta move these carrots and these pomegranates though. Um, just so we have more room and more storage for our food because we're doing a lot better than where we started. So I think we're doing okay with that. And then I also started making this, ooh, what's this? more franks and beans they made some franks and beans over there on the cauldron um, but we do have a cauldron now which is actually a grill but in order to make the herbal rabbinies you actually need a grill and i found this cauldron and i thought it'd be perfect for what we want to do uh because once rosie is probably a teenager she should be able to start brewing up potions and she's going to be the herbalist air slash healer of the tribe so that's gonna be really fun to do and in order to brew up some potions we need some of the bugs and some of the different plants that came with outdoor retreat so we have started the process with that let's see what is what is maddie doing he's taking care of little leaf i want maddie to actually let's see craft some more furniture we're going to need some more wall shelves uh for the herbalist little hut that we have and it looks really cute too like Let's go like that. See? Looks really cute. A little hut. <laughs> um, we might make some other little huts too around here. Um, but I kind of really like the caves. Like the tent caves. So maybe we'll just keep those. Hmm. I'm not too sure. Because those are just cool. They're just really, really cool. And let's see. How are you? She's sleeping. And Emma, she's also sleeping in the tent. And Tony, he's also... How many people can sleep in this tent? Oh my goodness. Like everybody's in the tent right now. And Rosie, she is going to go talk or play with the cow plant, which I don't know if that's a good idea. I don't know. This cow plant is dead over here. Let's see. Can she milk? She can play with it. Okay. Um, maybe we should, we should have somebody milk it. Somebody milk the cow plant. Um, the cow plant needs to be milked. It's like the morning chores. <laughs> we get a milk or cow plant. <laughs> yeah, let's see. He wants to propose a crazy scheme to someone. Make out with Lacey and discuss fitness techniques. Yes, Tony. Dream big, Tony. Dream big. And then where is Maddie still working? All right, so let's go ahead and speed this up a little bit. It is like the middle of the night, so we will be rolling for a random event um, very shortly. Um, it's actually like early morning instead of the middle of the night. And we will see what shall happen then. So he has finished a wood priest. I want him to, not a sculpture, but I want to make some more of those. We're going to need some more wall shelves. <laughs> We're definitely going to need some more. And what is little Rosie doing? She's doing her homework. <laughs> she is doing homework. I mean, we don't really go to school. I mean, she has been going to school a little bit. Um, when I don't catch her, but we're not really supposed to have her go to school since we are on a stranded, deserted island and we don't know anybody else. Let's see, little leaf. Oh my gosh, she is so cute. I love toddlers. Toddlers are amazing. Like, 
he's sleeping he's so precious i can't wait to see if lacy is actually going to have a little boy or a little girl to add to our tribe what, what does that look for like cool story bro like what are you even right now are you okay do you need help do i need to call a doctor what are you doing <laughs> Maddie, are you, are you guys like stuck? Like, what the heck? <laughs> what are why? Let's uh, cancel these. There we go. And why don't we have Tony practice the guitar slow? Because we do have guitars. Can Rosie use a guitar? No, she's too young. I think there are like children's guitars, but not today. Not today, not today. And then Maddie, he's making some more wall hangings. Lacey is pottying. Emma is sleeping. And let's see, how close are we to the baby? Two hours until the third trimester. Oh my goodness. That is so exciting. And it is 5.30. So we can actually uh, roll for a random event for today to see what is going to happen to our little tribe um, on the island right now. So let me go ahead and grab my phone. And we are going to roll for a random event. And... This is a lot of fun. I just found another challenge that kind of had like these random events as well. So it might be another challenge I might look into because I don't know, like there's just something about these random events that just like, it changes everything. Like everything can change in an instant. All right, so let me go ahead and roll this dice and we got number 12, ooh. All right, so let me go ahead and look and see what number 12 is and I'll be back with you guys once I know what today's event is going to be. Let me go ahead and, oh my goodness guys this is not good the gods are absolutely furious that you're disturbing their sleep sacrifice a sim to the volcano to calm him preferably a virgin um let the sim swim in a volcanic pool and block the border with stones or fences the sim has to drown to death oh my goodness we truly do have our first human sacrifice today um so it says preferably a virgin i don't think you can actually kill children um and those are the only virgins in the tribe so it definitely can't be rosy or leaf um and lacy is currently pregnant um emma has two children already um uh, maddie is kind of like the leader of the tribe Tony, I think it's going to have to be you, buddy. I mean, you wouldn't want your pregnant, um, I guess they're not married technically, but your pregnant, like, significant other to die, would you? Like, I think total, totally, like, Tony would sacrifice himself to save Lacey and his unborn child. This is really sad. Uh, wait, I don't want you to go to school. You can't go to school. It's time for a sacrifice. Don't you understand? <laughs> Oh my gosh, I don't want to sacrifice one of my sims. This is awful. Oh my gosh. Um, Alright, why don't we continue? Hold on. What are you doing? No. No, you need more wall hangings. Okay, when I get upset, you just you just need to make more wall, like, shelves. Um, yeah, we have to sacrifice him. I think, I think Tony is the only... I mean, we could do Emma or Maddie, but I feel like they are, like, the starter people of our tribe and I really don't want them. They would be last resort and then Lacey is pregnant and we'd lose the baby and that would be so so sad. And children, I don't think you can actually drown them in pools. I think the like social services would come and take them away before they actually died. So I think it's gonna be Tony, which is really sad because he's never gonna get to see his baby. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, so I think I'm gonna have Tony wake her up and I want them to, um, you know, say their goodbyes. I don't think that Lacey is going to understand what's happening. I think only Tony knows right now that, hey, like, the gods are really mad. And, uh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. So he's going to, you know, act like everything is fine. Um, ask to feel the baby. Going to hug her. Um, express how he feels about her and oh my goodness this is so sad this is so sad oh my gosh I want to cry <laughs> oh 
This this is the worst. Okay, this is what these random events are all about, though. Um, get to know a little bit more. Um, I guess we can have the Muhu the very last time. I, we can give them a little bit of time together. Um, before, no, why are you at school? You can't be at school. You need to leave school early. <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh, this is so, this is the last time you're gonna woohoo, Tony. And this is the last time you're gonna woohoo with Tony Lacey. She's very pregnant right now. Is she in her third trimester? Um, I think she, yes, she is. Okay. Maybe he will get to see the baby? I'm not sure. I mean, it is random. <laughs> she looks worried. She's like, we have to sacrifice one of our sins. She's like, I hope it's not me. Um, how is Leaf doing? He's a little bit hungry. I think we... He does have some food. He can probably... Oh, that's empty. What about this? He can eat some yogurt. Is it stinky? No, it's stinky. He can't eat that. That's gross. Uh, let's see. Is there anything in here that he can eat? He can eat some frank and beans. There we go. He can grab a serving of that. And have they finished? They have finished their lovemaking. And apparently it was good. Because they're both, like, pretty excited about it and um maybe let's come over here and say goodbye maybe he's gonna tell her over here like so i i kind of have to sacrifice myself and i love you and i'm gonna miss you and i'm going to miss my unborn baby this is so sad wait no come back we're saying goodbye you're about to die don't you understand the significance of this problem i want you to change your outfits hold on no no don't go swimming okay you know it's hard to sacrifice people sacrificing people is hard um, <laughs> all right i want you guys to say goodbye again i know they just did but i mean they need Passionate kiss. Um, as to feel the baby again. Why don't you share some of your fishing knowledge with her th so that she can use it um, when you're gone. And then he's going to have a deep conversation with her to kind of explain what is happening. Um, yeah. <laughs> this is so sad. <sighs> I don't want them to go. I I mean, I don't want Tony to go. I don't want anyone to go. Um. Oh my gosh. This is sad. <laughs> very, very sad. Okay. Yep. Um. It's gonna have to happen, though. And. Let's. Can we, like, say. I don't think we can actually say goodbye. I mean, we could go. Uh, wait, hold on. Wait. Well, I guess she's gonna go to sleep. You won't even know that your your significant other is about to die. So she's gonna go to sleep. Uh, we have to do it. The gods are probably mad that we took so long, but um, all right. So we're going to have to do do do. Let's see. How do I teleport? Let's see. Reset object. Can I teleport him in here? Hmm. All right, let's see. What can I do? See, I think we have to make like a ladder or something really quick. <laughs> um, something for them to be able to get in here. Um, so let's go ahead and grab a stair and see what we can do with this. Let's go ahead and place this and then there we go all right so we should be able maybe let's see can you swim laps in here yet he might not be able to you may have to remove some rocks really quick oh yeah we can take the things that are out of his out of his inventory um we can throw that on the ground throw the fish there we go pomegranate this water some more fish I mean, he has, he found, like, a bunch of guitars in the water. Like, this area is just, like, full of guitars. There we go. Here's some energy juice. <laughs> um, is he able to get, I don't think he can get up here. Um, let me go ahead. Let's see if I can remove some of these rocks so he can actually, like, get up. Let's see. Let's move this around. Oh, no. This is so sad. Like, this is so sad. Okay, so Tony, I got him in the volcano. 
And he's supposed to swim in here until he dies, and that is very sad. <laughs> oh my gosh, Tony. Poor Tony, you're never going to get to see your baby. This is awful. Oh my gosh, Tony. I'm sorry. Maybe Tony can come back as a ghost. I don't know how that works. Um, all right, but it's going to take a while for him to get tired, but he is going to die. Like, he has to die. It has to happen. Um, how is Lacey doing? She's still pregnant. Um, she's in her third trimester, so she can have the baby at any time now. And how is little Leaf doing? Uh, let's see, how is he? He still has a couple days. He's doing pretty good with his skills. I do want you to get more imagination skill. Where is your little kitty? Um, so you do have it in your inventory, I think. Yep, why don't you play with the kitty? Play with this right there. And then poor Lacey. Lacey, I'm sorry, Lacey. I'm sorry. That's so sad. Um, and then Rosie, she is cleaning up, I think? Or you should, actually. Yeah, let's have her clean up. Because uh, there's a lot of stinky things going on in here. Um, look for discarded toys. Ooh, we can find treasures in the trash can. That's pretty awesome. And what are you doing in here? You're going to play with some clay? Apparently, like, there's clay in here. <laughs> I guess they put, like, their clay over there. Oh, my gosh. And let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Maddie. He's so cute. Why don't you go ahead and light this and you can kind of like sit here and watch Leaf and see what he does. There's so many guitars. Um, maybe we can break down these. Oh my gosh. She's in there. What? What? <laughs> Uh, Rosie found a discarded Void Critter booster pack. Awesome. Uh, that is pretty amazing. I didn't know that was a thing. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Wow. All right. So Lacey, she's doing this. Okay. So Tony, he is still swimming up here. It's going to take some time. Um, but yes, he is going to die. And it doesn't look like we're going to be have the, having the baby in this episode. Um... But it's going to happen. Death is going to happen and it's sad. Oh my gosh. Um, so let me know what you guys think about this episode. Let me know if you think I made the right choice. Who would you guys have sacrificed to the gods um, out of this tribe of people? Would you have done Lacey and her unborn baby? Or would you have done Emma or Maddie? Um, I don't think you could have done the children, but you know. <laughs> yeah um but yeah so let me know what you guys think down in the comments below and i'll see you guys in the next episode of the sims 4 island challenge bye